big trucks. Big trucks and the Haye restaurant. I don't know. I, I think they are probably closed. That's okay though. I'm coming for these guys. Um, I wanted to show you this uh, road, the entry road to one of my favorite Allego chargers in the Netherlands. You've probably seen some footage already of this place because I've been here a couple of times before. Anyway, maybe you didn't. Why I'm here is because on my Tour de Charge that I'm doing, I obviously need to show you all the brands you can find in the Netherlands. And these EVtronic machines, which actually show EV box signs here. Um, I met them in uh, in France with the Mercedes. Yes, that's my tour. I met them in France in the Mercedes, and then um, that didn't go very smoothly. So I'm curious if the Model Three will actually um, like it better. I will tell you soon. Okay, swipe card. Hello, here's my plug surfing card. Authentication in progress. Charge card accepted. Thank you very much. A beautiful liquid cooled cable. And the birds. So, where do we find proof of what this machine actually is? Is there a sign on them saying saying something? Hmm. Seems they they hid it. That's weird. Why would you do such a thing? Look at the look at the energy generated by Eneco over here. Somewhere in there. That's where the power comes from. Um here, I like that uh, Allego actually puts here that charging speed is decided on by the vehicle, which is obviously true. Battery very low, yes, yeah. thank you very much. So, okay, yeah, the ramp up to 80 kilowatts, we've seen that before. 40 minutes to a full charge, we've seen that before. Pretty much the same every time I connect. If you've been following my videos, you have seen this quite a bit already. So now, we're s almost one and a half minutes in. So then we should see the ramp up happening soon. Of course, I started the video when I didn't connect yet. So it's lagging a bit behind. See, there we go. Yeah, please go to 100 and above. I'm ready. We're ready for the boost. Give it up for better charging speed. Or at least one and a half minutes into the charge, I think more. Ah, there we go. This is what we like to see. So after two minutes of charging, we're at 120 kilowatts. Probably will go to 130, but will it go above? I was navigating to a supercharger that's really close by, by to Nieuwegein, where I am right now. So I hope that the car put the battery in the right uh, heating mode. Although this is impossible to check as far as I know. So apparently we're stuck at 135 kilowatts. Or is it going up still? I'm not so sure. Well, that's a good score. Much better than what the Mercedes did. I will test the Mercedes uh, in the future when we're uh, out of these crazy times to see how it works at these machines because apparently the machines who look like these, like the one I met in 
France. There's actually two generations of them. For me, it's impossible to tell which is which. Uh, you see this light on the side. The plugs are very modern, so I wouldn't be surprised if this is second generation, but who knows? There's no information on the machines, which is quite extraordinary. Or am I just not paying attention? And I want there to be this, this, yeah, there's always somewhere you can find out like who manufactured the machines and whatever. And here they, they hid it. They put it away. They don't want me to know. They don't want us to know. Why is that? 136 kilowatts. We made it to 1000 kilometers per hour charge. Thank you so much, Model 3. The SR Plus. Easy come, easy go. So, yeah, normally you could go there for a veggie crocket. They have great veggie crockets and weed burgers. Veggie weed burgers. Yeah, we do these things in the Netherlands. Obviously, there's no weed in there. There's seaweed in there. Anyway, uh, yeah. This sign, the sign is new. You can also see the sand. It's young sand, as I like to call it. Last time I was here, I don't know, maybe January? Yeah, definitely somewhere in winter. The sign was not there. Now they're uh, actively spreading the Smooth app. That's the Allego charging app. Um, yeah, hardly, hardly use the app, I have to say. Um, yeah, more of a charge map uh, person. Okay, so it's dropping already. I have I have what I need the speed was okay now if I show my card here five minutes 10 kilowatt hours I'm gonna stop oh and then it wants the card again do you believe this stuff anyway and it also changed back to Dutch which is I started the session in English and it changed back to Dutch. That is not okay. Um, anyway. Yeah, so this is also funny. If you stop the charge on the machine, I really suggest you don't, then you still need to press unlock. Uh, yeah. I mean, probably, probably as a Tesla user, ooh, it's closed automatically. Probably as a Tesla user, um, yeah, you always connect to the supercharger and all these things I say, they don't matter to you. I mean, this is okay. I don't judge. So, uh, yeah, I wanted to show you this parking spot. Normally you can get great food here, but yeah, we're not in normal times. Signing out for now. EV box, Allego, thank you for the charge. See you next time. I don't think I ever heard so many birds here. Of course, you still hear the road also. I like the birds. And did I show you the classic tr triple charger and 22 kilowatts AC charging? It's all here. This is, this is how it's done. Maybe two triple chargers would have been even better. Ciao.